Phillies and the Cubs wrapping up a four-game series on Sunday. Dan Heron facing Aaron Harang. Harang falls behind in the top of the first. Chris Bryant digs in, runners on the corners, and two men away. First pitch, ground ball to the shortstop, and it gets past Freddie Galvis. That's going to score a run. Both runners will move up the base. Another RBI for Chris Bryant. 92 on the season. Three straight hitters that Aaron has been behind two balls and no strikes. Well, you like to see him make him pay for that, too. Here's the pitch. Swung on, grounded deep in the hole. Diving, Russell can't get it, a base hit. Herrera around third. They're waving him home. Schwarber's throw is high and offline. It gets past Montero, the catcher. It's an RBI single at a 2-1 to one Phillies lead. Fowler lines that one into the right. Center field gap, way oh. out for it is Brian Bogus 7. Wow, what a catch by that Bogus 7. Oh. That, that, that was a catch right there. He gets the thumbs up from Aaron Harang. Trust me, that, that is going on on national TV later today. Altair is a base runner with one out here in the bottom of the third. That'll bring up Brian Howard. Here's the 1-1. One -one. Howard swings and lifts one in the air to right field. Going back on it to the track and at the wall and caught. It just kept going and going and going. The and Brian Howard, his 22nd home run of the season. And the Phillies lead this one 4-1. to one. It's Two outs, two on, two, two pitch. Ground ball, chopper, second base. Charging it is Hernandez who loses the handle. And he collides with Rizzo down there at first base. A run is going to score. Hernandez is down. You see, Hernandez charges it and then just loses the handle in the transfer. Tries to flip it at the last minute and then the collision right there. Talk about adding uh, insult to injury. Injury to insult, I guess, in that regard. And that is going to be the end of the day. Man. It does look like something involving the hand. Billy's with a man at third base and now two down. And Cameron Rupp will be the batter. 1-0. And it bounces in the dirt, gets away at the plate. Here comes Altair. He'll score. And the Phillies score on a wild pitch to take the lead here in the bottom of the seventh. It's 5-4. to four. Phillies earn a split of the four-game series with a 7-4 win. The Cubs now 4-3 on their 11-game road trip. Chris Coughlin tied a career high with four hits on the day and became the second Cub this season to hit two triples in a game, joining Dexter Fowler. A no decision for Aaron Harang following five innings of three-run ball.